Welcome to Tina Product Shop. So this is our second live stream today. And we already done Capricorn set. Now we're gonna move back to Valentine's set. I am working with 3D. I will show you the look. So uh, I call this the uh, angelic heart. We're gonna work with Cali and we can work with Claydos. So uh, let me type in my website. Everything I use is at www.tinovo.shop. Let me uh, also share WhatsApp group. And this is our WhatsApp group, just in case you haven't joined yet. This is a group that you can join to get our uh, alert. Every time that I go live, I go on there to notify everyone. And every time that we have sale, I also notify the coupon on there also. And now, give me just a second. Just a second. Okay. I'm gonna try to connect to the other account. Request to join. How do you even request to join? Okay. There we go. Now I have to click a set. Lesson is not here, so I have to do multitask. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, well, look at me. Two, two screens. I'm going to be low. Not right. Would you help it? Oh, I, I am doing this and uh, work right now. I'm here behind the screen. Just give me a second. <laughs> okay. Oh, all the way up there. All right, let's get started. Light. Okay, Tara moderators. Oh, see what how does and I remember everything. Where's Tara? Tara, can you shoot me a text? Oh, I find you right here. Uh, can you shoot me a text, Tara? Where do you do your clothing shop? So uh, some of my clothes is given to me by my audience. Some of my clothes, my friend made it for me. And some I just ordered from O2. O2 is my favorite place to order uh, clothes at. It's a Germany-based company. And it's for flamboyant gay men. That's what that clothes is for. So that's why I love it. Because I am a flamboyant gay man. For today, anyway. At least for today. <laughs> oh, Charger, Charger. Yes, thank you. Okay, I am all good. Oh, I, have, I still have Tara. You see. Is Tara text me yet? Oh, uh, I don't see Tara text. Have you texted me yet, Tara? She's uh, in here. She might not be in here. Okay. So, first, I need a cream nude for sure here. Uh, I don't know about, about these now yet. Let's just finish this now first. Okay. 
Okay. Oh, that's Tara. Okay, I'm adding Tara. Oh, I have to like confirm the other screen too. Give me a second. Print over here. Okay, Tara. Hear this you know let's make the rest of this uh purple ombre too this is a pigment that i choose i get if i use gel it'll be easier but for some reason i choose this pigment and it's a little bit tricky first i apply on nude it's a little dark so i um so then i apply uh, a white ombre just to bring out the color a little more. Hear this. This one also nude. I'll show you the color when I'm done. Okay, hear this. Let's pop in a white ombre. Pigment base. Ombre brush. And some top coats, some shine dip, just to lubricate your brush a little bit. some white on mm, I would say half and half oh, I forgot to show you the color this is a background top, top gel cream nude and this color right here is pigment base. Wipe up extra. I don't want any gel to be on here when I'm doing this. Remember to keep your brush very clean for your ombre. Now, hear this. Mm -hmm. 
And I do ombre on the pinky and thumb also. Only target the edge. And you just spread that edge out so it gets thinner and thinner and thinner. Okay. When it get to here, you see your bread? You don't want this. I want to clean this. And you don't want it too much top coat needs this. Just want to blend it and then wet it back with a little top coat so it's not too dry. If your ombre is super streaky, that's because the amount of top coat in there is too much. Too much to handle, that's why it becomes streaky. Remember, you want your brush to be dry. Cure this. Give it the same thing right here. Okay. Keep it dry. Spreading it out, just the tips. Okay, dry it again. Okay, so now you should work on the new edge. Clean it. But see, when, after you clean it, it might get a little dry. That's why I just dip in a little top coat, just, just to sort up. Moisten it a little bit, but you just don't want too much top coat. You just want just a tad bit. You don't, if you don't need, an, if you uh, don't have any top coat and you do fine, then you don't need top coat. Don't think that the top coat is the part that will help do the ombre. It's not. It's your brush, the gel, and how dry you keep your brush, how clean you keep your brush. Yeah, this. Okay. Okay, now using the same base gel, I only apply one coat, so I'm going to apply the second coat and ombre it down just to blend everything together before I put on pigments. Hear this? And I'm gonna brush it kind of like over the ombre part where the white blend is, I'm brushing over it. You still can see it though when you blend it out.
here. Okay, so it's pigment time. Let's move this over here. Okay, now I need a periwinkle pigment. Blue out. Purple in there. More purples. More white. This one gonna be a lighter colors. I feel like I should become a makeup artist. Okay. Now let's clean up a little bit. I am ready. Clean brush. I will use matted to adhere pigments. Okay, I'm gonna use this. Apply one coat and cure for ten seconds. using the light just to make sure that everything is nice and smooth. You don't want it to be streaky. Okay, good. Now, here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You know, I'm gonna tilt on the side and kill the side just in case. I don't want it to be too wet. Yeah. A little bit on each side. Now, make a little bit of this. Knock off the dust. And start to blend.
clean it just a little and move it like these colors. No lighters. Not too light though, just a little bit. And okay, now a lighter one. Brush it back. Keep tearing it for about 50 seconds. I do this one. Like I mat it on and tear for just 10 seconds. Make sure that it's all smooth all around. Put it in the machine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. I wonder when people like uh, a comment of mine on WhatsApp, is it alert people? Because it's alert me. I hope it doesn't alert people because then it will be too much notification. Get this get this out. I'm gonna put mat over it. This one is already here for sixty seconds.
there, but it, yeah. I get that pigment only necessary if I want to blend two color, but with just one color, I should have just mix a gel. That'd be easier for me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Mm -hmm. Just like eyeshadow. Light. Yeah, this. I top coat this. Yeah, this. Top coat this. Okay, now I am going to make my angel wings. some art gel. I'm going to mark it first. White art gel. Oh, I have to get the new 10 millimeter. Give me a second. Let me get the 10 millimeter brush.
this out. Roll it around. Start right here. Let me move this closer together so I can see better. Okay, start right about here. Going up to about here. And going back down. This is how far it will go. And it go all the way down here. Okay. Get it. Okay. Oh, this one is loose. One, two, three, four. Let's go all the way up here too. And one line to the right. I usually uh, move like this because I don't want to switch angle when I'm doing twinkle. So I'm just move all in one direction and then I can switch to the other direction. And it's milky. Okay, so I'm going to use milky. I'm going to add glare into the middle of the twinkle.
Apply matted. Here, Smoke you. And this is opal crystal. Um, I have a opal crystal set on the bling category already. And the size of this stone are uh, SS5. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm going to use white glitters and I need a silicone tools for this and I need a clear surface
Actually, not help if I have all this color on my glove. I have to clean it all up. I learned that lesson somewhere along the way. Make sure everything's clean. Okay. So I'm going to use clay potatoes. Going to be on the website tomorrow. And whenever it's on the website, it's going to be at in the 3D categories. I'm going to take this much out. I throw it into a noodles. One, two, three, four. Okay, so I'm gonna do one, two, three, four of this feather first. Okay, it's all tilted up and then slowly slanted, and this last one is right across. Oh, that's a knife. And I'm gonna take my sticky out. I'm gonna do the first one without sticky, just to show you. Cause this is drier, so it need a little help to adhere on the surface. You just place it on here gently like this. Use your finger to just keep it here. Yeah. And whenever it's on the surface, you can oops, spell up again. Okay. Okay. So whenever it's on the surface, you can tap it lightly just to stick it in. And then you're good to go. But I am going to use sticky so it's easier for me, you'll see. Make sure everything's good. You know, I I think that this one is a little thick. Like a little up. Still trying to remember how I do the feathers. Bear with me. I did that feather uh, a few days ago, so I forgot what I did. Okay. One, two, three, four. Okay, so I'm going to use my sticky now. Lie a little bit out here. So I'm gonna have one feather right here. It's like here. One, two, three. And that should be good enough. Now, come on. my next feathers. There you go, and it's thick.
Now it's one, two, and then three. Okay, got it. Okay. This one is slightly bigger. Okay, one, two. Two, and then three.
ask what happened when I get something I like. I choose like the most time consuming art ever. Feathers, 3D feather. I'm not even happy with just regular feather. I have to have 3D feather now, Lord. Just months ago, I was still happy with just some painting feather, maybe some texture effect feather, but no. I just have to have that 3D feathers. Back in the old day, you used to do this with acrylic. If I ever want to feel thankful for something, I was thankful that I don't have to work with timing like acrylic does. Ugh. You know, after playing with this, I find absolutely no reason to go back to 3D acrylic. The whole thing just freaked me out. Ooh. Have to work with timing and everything. Which worked back then, but now today, who would want to work with timing anymore? Who would want to be like, oh, you have to get this correct in three seconds? Or else you screw. Oh. Let's see. Where is all this little hair come? It's from my clothes. Oh no. Tiny hair, too small for pubic hair. It's like tiny little hair, like little, like little leprechaun hair or something. Tiny, like little fuzz. The heck, where does that come from? This grab another one. This one is semi big. I wish I was fortunate enough to play with clay when I was little. I have no experience with clay. I just start learning about it now. I wish, you know what, I should go take like a pottery class or something. That would be so fun. To learn about all the tool that they have. I know they use this in uh, clay making. Another small one.
Okay, hear this? Now, that's the inside the wings. But I say, I make it complicated. So that's the inside the wing. Now we're gonna do it outside. I start with this, 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 and this, and then these are just extra I decided to throw in at the end. I like, it needs some more feathers. <laughs> Ooh, now, this one have to be like, like correct, have to be about right here. So from here, okay. this is gonna be a big one too. Buy some sticky. Yeah, like this. Only apply a little bit of sticky, by the way, not too much. You just want a little touch just to adhere it, that's all. Just to make it stick, so you don't need like a lot. There you go, and it's thick. You just want that's that's the whole purpose. It just just for it to be on the surface easier, and then when it on the surface, sticky no longer uh, hold any purpose. Now it's up to you to mold it. That's all. Need a little bit more, just a tad bit more. I would say it's about there.
you know what? Uh, this one of the experience. It's either it's I'd rather for it to be longer because I can cut it. But sh shorter I have to try to extend it out. That's one thing that I should note it. See, this one should have be a little bit up here so it can cover this white line. You see that? The white line that I sketch out. Put that in notes too. Forget that. Minor little detail like that matters. When you do this feather, be careful with the twirl because that's very elegant twirl. Watch out for the pattern here. There's a lot of sway line going on there. I obviously have been hating when I'm uh, making this because
Let me make sure before I clear. Okay, good. Oh my God, look at these feathers. Okay, so from here, it's gonna wrap in to here, okay. Lord. You know, that's why I make two heart. That's why I make this too. Because to me, this is beautiful. So it's appropriate for public. But I was like, you know what? I want one that I put a full wings like this. <laughs> that's why I make two. <laughs> one for everybody and one for me. <laughs> okay, let's see. Oh my God. This feather is even more complicated. Okay, it's from here, it's going out and give it a little space and then from here going up. Alrighty then. Oh, I have a little white spot. That's why I hate.
Vámonos. Yes. Okay. Let's see. A little bit right here. Hi. Hey. Yeah. Missed you. You know what? When I do in this now, I don't wear gloves. And you know what? I'm gonna say it right now. I like no club better. This all this low hair. I know you don't see it. Well, that's only a, that's only a few here. That's, so many people are allergic to so many different things. I know. There are only a that few here choice. though. But here, I mean, all it takes is a few that make me kind of irritated. To share with you, that's what I like. I like no gloves. Hi. Did you miss me? Yes. Did you? Oh, let's try something that beautiful. And then, huh? So what? 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 What is beautiful? This Capricorn. Uh -huh. oh, that's old news. Old news. That's like an hour ago. That's oh, old news. Yeah, yeah. You know what? Not. Now that I'm looking at it closer, it looks like an antique. Oh, God, and it was a pass. Oh, these old things? These old things. Capricorn white? Who? <laughs> well, on to my next things. Uh, Aquarius. Never done a set of Aquarius uh -oh, before. Uh-oh, they said I need to give you a spanking. What'd you do? A spanking? What did I do? I, don't, I, I was a good boy. Those freaks. They just want to spank him for no reason. You, well, you know what it is. You know what it is. What's that? Uh, <clears throat> I got on and was trying to get you to drink water. Uh -huh. And me and 130 other people were like, water, water, water. Uh -huh. And there you are. Water of us. My angelic heart. Let's put them close together. I know I need to kill this, but let's put them close. <gasps> These are fun. Oh, this is my dream. I always love an angel wings like this. Those are majestic. So I did this. I don't care if it hit or not. I don't care. I just love this. Now this, I did it for you guys. More elegant. I chop it in half. It have a little bit of wing detail. Just a, just a little bit. That's pretty too. Okay. Oh, I'm done. Oh, what? Yeah. We'll drink some water, celebration water. Time for the next slide. Yeah. Okay. Now, <clears throat> this doesn't have a lot of feathers. It doesn't have a lot further overlap it but i kind of warn you <clears throat> this cup right here have to be on point the first finger easy the first finger you do whatever you want but the second one have to be like on point have to match it and i mean these are fine but these two last one are like have to be like, like wispy it have to be like this i'm a little nervous We'll see when I dive into it for the second one. Because I love that one so much, I want that these other nail to be like identical. So, 
these old things after you get them with your beautiful picture and you just throw them on my hands. That's old things. Actually, I had to wear these in the show. Okay. I'll do everything one handed. It doesn't match your hand on your finger size. Oh, I've got I've got a new technique. It would be make fit. <laughs> oh, let's do another set. It's eight already. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let me check on my post. I post at 519. I have nothing to do. You want to check it on here? Yes. Yeah. Oh, man. I just got everything set up. 519 right now is almost eight. That's almost three hours. Let's see. Three hours, forty five hundred. Okay, it's okay. Forty five eighty four. Eight nineteen. Eight plus nineteen. Twenty seven. I get so thirty three. Um, one fifty, one fifty three, four five a four, four five a four divided by one fifty three. Triples. 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 Good. It's okay. Because it was a post I post last year anyway. I'm out of content. Gotta get this done before I uh, take pictures. I hate to take pictures in between. That like if I have nine set, I gotta done on nine set <laughs> before I take pictures. Oh, I, I know how you are. You're very chunk, or you don't like to be scattered. I don't like to be scattered because I, all at once. I have too much going on. If it's scattered, I might forget it. I have two left, two nails left. Ooh. Two nails sets left? left. Mm -hmm. Well, oh. I will give you half a bite of some food just so you're. What nailing. kind of food? Well, what we mean, what kind of food? You oh, Indian food. Night? Yes, I remember. We need oh, Indian. Yes. You're not excited no more? I am. I still am. You don't sound very excited. Yeah, I am. Do I need to make a mad dash somewhere? No. Close. That, I have so much to get done. I know, but that, that doesn't mean I can't jet boom, bam. And I was just talking nibble food. Okay. I'm going to take a picture of it. And I will post it right away. Thank you, everyone. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And I, I will uh, get back on and I will do another set. Un trabajo uh, uh, 